it's possible for folks to get the impression that what we're doing with tapping is just trying to get rid of bad feelings. And, you know, a lot of people talk about negative emotions, and I don't believe there are negative emotions. I think there are uncomfortable emotions, but all emotions are part of the human spectrum. And they're there for a reason. You know, we, we experience things like fear and anger and sadness because something inside of us is saying that there's a problem. And so what we want to do is not just try to stuff those feelings down or avoid them or get rid of them, which is what we have been taught to do. And that leads to all kinds of unfortunate consequences, but we want to process them. And so that's what we're doing with tapping. So let's go ahead and do that. So if there's something that you're feeling, some uncomfortable emotion you'd like to process and move through, please take full responsibility for your own well-being. Even though I have this feeling, I choose to love and accept myself. Even though I'm feeling this, I choose to love and honor myself. Even though I'm feeling this and I am not enjoying it, and I'd like to get to the other side of it, and even though I'm feeling this, I choose to deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself. And maybe anyone else who might be involved because I choose to feel that free. This feeling that I'm experiencing, all these things that I'm feeling And all the thoughts behind that sometimes it's thoughts that lead to feelings sometimes feelings lead to more thoughts and sometimes those are really uncomfortable and sometimes it goes down in a negative spiral that just does not feel good. And I'm allowing myself to process this. I'm checking in with what's going on inside. Taking a look at those thoughts. Taking a look at those feelings. And I'm asking myself a few questions about those. Whether it's the thought or the feeling, I choose to ask myself, is this true? Am I responding to something that is factual? Or is it possibly a misunderstanding? And I'm making much ado about nothing. Not because I'm bad or stupid, but because I'm human and can be confused. So before I get really upset about this, I'm giving myself permission to ask, is this true? I can also ask myself, is this necessary? Whatever I'm feeling, 
Is this a necessary response? What would happen if I didn't feel this? What am I afraid would be the consequences if I didn't experience this discomfort? And is that true? Is it helpful? Experiencing this emotion. How useful is this? Is it providing some kind of service to me or others? And if not, maybe I can move through it. I thought it was necessary. And now I'm allowing myself to move through it. And is it kind? Is it kind to myself to experience this? Is it kind to others? Because there may be times when I endure a discomfortable, an uncomfortable experience as an unkind act towards someone else. Not because I'm an awful human being. It's just a learned behavior. And maybe I can cut myself some slack and let that go. So with these uncomfortable thoughts and feelings, I'm giving myself permission, permission to question them. Are they true? Are they necessary? Are they helpful? Are they kind? And if not, maybe they've been around long enough. And I can process it, move through it, release it, and get back to a place of peace, allowing myself to clear what doesn't feel like peace in body, mind, and spirit. Take a deep breath. And thank you for allowing yourself to go through that process because it gives you a freedom to think more clearly, come up with better choices, take better actions that benefit you and countless others. So thanks for doing that. And if there's more stuff that comes up, I'm here for you. Thanks.